Tracy uh, Ryan Tibbetts, who represents the elders, council of our small band, come and say a few words too. Thank you. Everyone, welcome. It's good to see um, all of you here. Such a diverse group. And it's not only just First Nations, it's everybody. I would like to thank the uh, hereditary chiefs for coming, being part of this and supporting us. I represent the elders group for the Burns Lake Band. And we had, we did a, a survey uh, a year and a half ago, our chief put a survey out and we uh, tracked everybody that did the survey. And for our small band, we had 94% of our band members that said no to Enbridge. And uh, a year ago, we asked our chief and council of the Burns Lake Indian Band what the results were, and we never did find out what their tally was. And uh, a month ago, we find out uh, Enbridge sent them a letter saying that they're coming into our territory to start doing surveys. And uh, we keep asking um, our councillor, Ron, Ron Charlie, has asked chief and council, because he's a councillor as well, and uh, he's repeatedly asked for the information on what kind of deals our chief and council is making with Enbridge, with PTP, with any of the other oil companies, or industry for that matter. And he's been continuously denied any of that information. They've even give, give, have the gall to, to try to fire him from his position as a councillor. They can't do that. But it's just something politically that we're dealing with for the Burns Lake Band, and uh, it's pretty sad. But if you look at the map behind me, beyond the chiefs there, it shows where the, the pipeline is going through. It's going through the channel between Burns Lake and Decker Lake, which is just over here, less than a kilometer away. That's where the pipeline is gonna cross. So, you know, it's gonna kill Decker Lake, it's gonna kill this, it's gonna kill everything around this area if it goes through, if there's ever a leak. I mean, they say it's the safest thing, but I mean, look how many leaks they've had since they've made the announcement. They say it's safe, but it's not. So the people, you people need to know, the elders and our community members from the Burns Lake Band have voiced no and said no to Enbridge. Yet our leadership has signed deals with them. We've asked and requested information of what kind of deals they've signed and they've continuously denied all that information to us. So we're, we're in the black, we're in the dark, just the same as you guys. Um, there is a web page, I'm not sure if I should mention it, but it's called a respect page that we've been battling with Chief and Council, but uh, just for information, uh, some of our members that protest against our Chief and Council, uh, we're being charged now for defamation of character. And, uh, so basically, uh, uh, we're not allowed to voice our opinion against our chief or councillor. I'm sure you all know who they are. I'm not going to mention any names because they may get charged again. So basically, uh, the Burns Lake Band elders uh, have said no to Enbridge, and we will continue to say no. Thank you. Thank you.